It may be the only building in the world where having slimy green things growing on the walls is considered a plus. In fact, inside the thin glass panels, this algae, millions of tiny plants, will help sustain other life inside the housing unit, humans needing heat in the chilly local winter. One of the inventor calls the outside algae facade a bioreactor. Well, it converts solar radiation into heat and into biomass. The algae use the solar radiation in the photosynthetic process and build up biomass, organic matter. At the same time, the light which is not used by the algae is converted into heat. The biomass is collected inside the building's control room and sent from there to an ecological power plant, generating more energy. The algae house is just one of 18 experimental buildings with 170 apartments set up in land once used by industry here in Hamburg. Together, the structures form the International Building Exhibition, a real-time urban research and development laboratory. The idea behind it is to convert this, what was once a crime-ridden neighborhood, into a model of urban planning. And the algae house has been generating the most excitement of late. Including that of investors. There is public research money in the project, but also private. This project will cost us, but we hope that the boost to our image and the know-how we're acquiring will put us ahead of the game for projects in the future. The microscopic plants are locally sourced. They grow best in the local climate. The skies in this part of Germany are often grey and the winters long. That's a special challenge for what's been nicknamed algetecture, but the developers say if the idea works here, it can work anywhere. Nick Spicer, Al Jazeera, Hamburg.